I was going to say that how do you do it? Oh, so the owner? So, so they're acting, they're not acting for the public. No. They're acting as private officers. You guys are acting as private officers. We're not having a conversation like this. I'm fucking believable. They got paid to do a job once as well. I'm fucking believable. Yeah. You know that you guys. Yeah, you guys are real. You're special. Oh, we have, a, we have a third officer here. Let me. I'm sorry, can I get you to identify yourself, please? It's McDade, 10318. 10318? Okay, and can I just see your name, please? Yeah. Are you guys like brothers? We are. I identified myself to you. I've got their badge numbers. These guys are actually brothers. Thank you very much. These guys are brothers. <laughs> Are they really McDade? Yeah. McDade yeah. and McDade, they're brothers. They're brothers. So guys, this is why the truckers this is why the truckers were in Ottawa today, guys. Because of this bullshit right here. Thug number one, thug number two, thug number three, pay for with our taxes. Is this the world you want to live in? Will you fund thugs to stop you from entering into a building? Is this the world we want? That's why you support the truckers. Not thug number one, thug number two, and thug number three, who don't and can't even cite the law. And we all know that the bylaw states that you don't need to show your medical exemption. These pieces of shit. And you know what? I always say I back the blue. And you know what? The municipal police have always said that they'll back us. These pieces of shit, piece of shit number one, piece of shit number two, and piece of shit number three, okay, are part of the OPP, and the OPP has always said that they will not support us. So fuck the OPP, okay? And I'm a little irritated because these guys are acting as public officers right now because we have not been trespassed. The owner called these guys to do the dirty work for them and act as private security. So our publicly funded officers are on the on route right now, acting as private security for the freaking on route. What do you think of that, guys? So how about this, everybody? Get off your asses, go to Ottawa, and support the truckers and stand with the truckers, guys. I am not, I'm done with this shit. I'm done with these officers acting like assholes because that's what they're doing in this moment. Let's call it what it is. So guys, get off your asses, stand up, get yourself to Ottawa and support the truckers because the truckers are doing this for us. I'm pissed right now. I'm, I gotta pee like a racehorse. <laughs> Your guys are really hating me right now, I'm sorry to say. And you know what? You know what I carry with me all the time? Guys, this is what I carry with me all the time. We back the blue. Thank you for all we do. Well, not today. You guys are a disgrace to your Contact dad. us at this location. We're going to do notices of liability, progressive notices of liability against these guys. We're going to charge them all $35,000. We're going to take all of them to small claims court. All right. Please contact us. Guys. Here you go. If you want you to file a, a, a notice of liability for these three men, uh, sorry, I don't know if you got on camera him asking, asking for my exemption for that. Yeah. 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 I'm almost out of buttons. I'm sorry. Uh, we are standforthee.ca. Standforthee.ca. All right, good job, guys. You're doing a great job for our country. Can't wait to bill you. This is going to be fun. So just just so we're clear, we have made you aware of the crimes you are committing, the the bylaw that you uh, the, the the fact that you have not asked, uh, or you're not acknowledging or being able to cite the bylaw you're supposedly enforcing, and and the fact that you've you've violated the Bill of Rights. No, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. Okay, well, you know, so you have been informed. We give you a minute to rectify. Yep. Oh, don't oh. forget 366 of the criminal code. Oh, yes. Yes. And if you guys do write us any tickets, we I'm fully aware that any false document, once you've been made aware of the crimes you're committing, would be, would be a false document, which is forgery under 366 subsection 1 of the criminal code of Canada. So just keep that in mind as well. Oh, but you are committing fraud because you're perpetuating this fraud. Well, and also they can't cite the legislation, which, by the way, the bylaw says if you have an exemption, you can enter a building and you are not required to show that so so $5,000 for fraud, $5,000 for extortion, $5,000 for uttering threats, $5,000 for public excitement of hatred, 
I'm trying to think what else. Five thousand dollars for breach of privacy and five thousand dollars for um informed consent. So would you get seven? Five five. Let's see. Public incitement of hatred, uttering threats, extortion, assault, the breach of privacy. Yep, and informed consent. Thirty-five thousand dollars. That's a thirty-five. We just let them know the thirty-five thousand dollars. What we're gonna do if they don't let us in? Notice of liability for you. Mr. McDade, no, liability for you, Mr. McDade, and for Mr. Farrow, who would not identify himself because he feels he's above the law. Yes. So, At least you guys know the law, though. Yes, yes, we, do. Know the law. yes we do. We know the law because we work with legal professionals that work within the legal provisions that we are afforded in Canada. Unlike the disgraceful law, and unlike the disgraceful Well, my friend, I think our job here is done. Our job here is done. No, no, we're not here to get arrested, but we are happy to do the notice of liability. Now, even if 10 of us do it, that's 350000 for each of these people. Yeah. Make sure you contact us, okay? Excellent. So contact us. We will help you set up the notice of liability, and we will get it commissioned online, okay, with electronic signature and the whole nine yards. We've got it covered. You help us, we'll help you. I hope you guys are familiar with the Bills of Exchange Act because all of this fill, falls under True Bill of Commerce. Well, they don't even know the legislation. They can't even write the all right. Well, we got their names. They gave them a chance to rectify. Notice is done. We will be serving you. Thank God for truckers that are trying to do something. These guys are ashamed. Not these shameful people standing at the door. Shameful people standing at the door. Police officers. They're supposed to serve and protect. They're supposed to serve and protect. No, we have a purpose what we're doing right now. No, don't know me. Don't forget your own. Don't forget your own. Don't forget your own to serve and protect. No, I don't do that. I don't do that. No, I don't do that game. Thank you. I don't do that. I'm really sad that this is what we're So are we. So are we. You sad at the wrong person. You're sad at the wrong person. Contact us here. We're going to be doing We've already given them a notice. We're going to be billing them $35,000 each. And we'll help, we'll teach you how to do it. And we'll, we got their information. We know who they are. Shame, shame, shame. They just called them. They just called them because of people like me.